we're going to go over the MCL and to start with we put the probe over the medial joint line and identify the femur which is on the left side of the picture and the tibia which is on the right side of the picture okay so first of all we can line up so we can see a nice thick bit of what is the MCL the superficial part on the femur side see the longitudinal fibers quite nicely follow it all the way up to the proximal attachment and you follow it back and then we're going to go to the joint line again so you can see where the cursor is is a superficial layer now the deep layer of the MCL sits on top of the meniscus so the meniscus the peripheral margin is here the anterior edge and on top of that that bright echoic hyperechoic uh, is the deep MCL layer and it anchors to the tibia and it anchors to the femur and that's stuck to the meniscus so you've got the superficial layer going over the top and a deep layer below that sticking to the meniscus. If we go back to the superficial uh, layer of the MCL, then we can follow that distally to the tibia. And just go over the tibia, drop it down, and you can see that the bone the tibia has is of this conca concave um, uh, shape, which is where the pes anserinus lives. The MCL goes through that area. You can also see the blood vessels as your marker. And then on top of that, also the pes anserinus tendons sort of going over it in an oblique way and the, the deep fiber the, the fibers of the MCL continue to go quite distally all the way to finish this off in periost quite far distally on the tibia so do follow that all the way to the attachment the, sup, the superficial fibers of the MCL and we come back and then we're back at the joint line okay then we can do a valgus test we can do it in any angle of the knee. We've got the knee at the moment in about 30 degrees uh, flexion. That's because that's quite a comfortable position for the, the patient, if they, especially if they have a knee injury. But also it gives us the ability to move into extension, into flexion and do a valgus test. And you can see when you do a valgus test how it sucks the meniscus, the peripheral margin of the meniscus into the joint. And you can feel at the same time when you do this test how the MCL tightens up. And you can do it in any angle. You can see how the joint widens when you do that. So that's a, a dynamic test for the MCL on the ultrasound guidance. Mm -hmm.